Congratulations on your graduation. Thank you for inviting me in this special day. I really, really glad to speak in here because I really love this school, just like you. I think most of you hope to finish my speech uh, quickly and uh, want to enjoy your remaining school days. So I try to finish my speech within five minutes and try to make it interesting. So first of all, I read the chapter one of Moby Dick, <laughs> Call Me Ishmael, some years ago. <laughs> Not sure. Today I'm here to speak to you just one thing that is important for you. This is about freedom. As you know, the tradition of this school is freedom. Maybe most of you believe this school is freedom because you are allowed to dye your hair and put on makeup and wear plain clothes. Of course, this is a kind of freedom. And when I was in this school, I also dyed my hair, such as red or gold and something, <laughs> and went to school with crazy clothes. <laughs> However, please think, is it a true freedom? I think not. Go back to my story. Uh, when I was third grade, all of the teachers said, go to university. Going to university is the best choice of your life. So in this time, uh, I didn't have any question to go to university. But one day, it just before uh, university examination, I realized a question that do I really want to go to university? Then I noticed I used to decide my hair and my clothes, but I didn't decide my, in my future. Maybe most of you same because all of the teachers said go to university. <coughs> and many people go to university in Japan because this choice is uh, most common. I do not say that do not go to university, but I want to think what you want to do. <coughs> in my case, now I belong to vocational vocationary school and work at part-time job as a sports instructor. So I'm really, really busy every day because there are many assignments and uh, there are many restrictions. Uh, so I have to cut my hair short and uh, of course I can't dye my hair such as red or gold. And, but I think I feel I'm freedom now because all of this is that I select myself. So now I'm really happy and enjoy my life. Uh, what I want to say is, please find it that you want to do and make effort in order to do that you want to do. Because your life is only yours. Do not spend your time waste. In Japan, if you hope and make effort, you can become anything and you can do everything. I think it's a true freedom. Not dye your hair and uh, play, uh, wear free clothes. In Japan, we can do this. It's really amazing. Uh, Stanley Baldwin, a British politician, also said, I quote, Man, that's not too late to build aspirations. Aspiration means ambition. So, and say again, please find it that you want to do. You can choose your life or your future. Thank you for listening and uh, I hope you are a bright future. Thank you. <laughs>